What is up guys, it's your boy Steve Ogan and I'm back again for yet another video review. And today we're gonna to be talking about the FPV Cycle 1303 5K motor. So another 1303 motor on the channel. And what I can say about the motor is I really, really like it a lot. It's another good motor, another good choice for you know your toothpick or you know your ultra light style of motors. I believe the motor is you know currently out of stock right now. And I would tell you to go with the a Maxino 1303-48K motor, but that motor seems to be out of stock as well. So I don't know if they're going to be coming back with it or, or what. I know Chinese New Year, you know, things are, you know, not getting restocked as quickly as they usually do. But yeah, these are out of stock too at the time of the video right now. So on FPV Cycles website, but yeah, uh, this is a, a two millimeter shaft as well just like the uh, Maxino motor and they run very very smooth they're extremely efficient as well so these don't have a really really strong magnet so it doesn't take a whole lot to spin these motors up so it's going to give you that really nice smoothness you know in the air and when you're flying this type of motor it just feels way smoother than you know your 110x you know size motor so that's the the biggest uh, upgrade that I found when using these motors and the efficiency. I remember, you know, back in the day, you know, the fly times on these type of builds, you know, that were a little bit heavier, you know, you're lucky to get maybe three, three and a half minutes sometimes. But now the efficiency on, you know, these micro builds is just through the roof now. And they're just even more and more enjoyable to fly now. And they're flying so good that they're, you know, they're hitting that, you know, characteristics where they have that same characteristics or feel of a five inch. But of course, they're not going to have the same throw. But I mean, they're it's pretty up there. So they just feel a little bit more nimbler in the air. But yeah, these these motors are uh, very, very good. I'm very, very pleased with them. And I really haven't had any issues with them. The only thing, the only tip I would tell you about using, you know, these type of props right here is that the tolerance doesn't seem as tight as something like these Gen Fan by blades. So uh, these props seem to, you know, slip off the shaft a lot easier. So I would recommend you use prop screws. Here are the three 3S batteries that I tested out with the 1303 motor. So we have the 3S550, 3S300, and the 3S350. So the 3S350, I was getting close to about four and a half minutes, and the 3S300, about four minutes. And the 3S550, again, six to seven minutes, which is pretty crazy. Uh, with these two batteries right here, the build felt, you know, flying the build felt very, very nimble. My build is coming in at about 67 grams or so and you know it felt very very light and nimble it's pretty crazy the uh the 3s 550 uh again like seven minutes which is pretty crazy and that's taking account that you're using you know the rpm filtering with the jazz mavic uh, 48 hertz or the 24 hertz that you're gonna get those you know crazy flight times these 1303 motors are coming in at six grams a piece so i'm gonna throw a few clips right now of the motor spinning up with the props and without the props. So let's go ahead and rip these 1303 motors outside 
and show you some footage. We'll be right back. All right, so the battery I'm using is the 3S550, and we're on the 1303 5K motors right now with the TP3. And yeah, these motors are just extremely smooth, just like the Maxino 48K motors. Hopefully those motors will come back in stock as well. These are out of stock too as well. I'm running, um. Jazz Mavic RPM filters 48 hertz on this uh, quad 2 as well. But you can just hear how how clean the motors and these props sound. It's just a perfect combination of power and efficiency in my opinion. And I just love these micros because you can fly them like 5 inches you know, in your front yard. You don't have to worry about bothering any neighbors. They're really uh, light and nimble. They're not very loud either. Let's do a little Matty. But yeah. Motor spin up very very smooth. I'm using the uh, Pyro Drone Pyro Patch right now. And right now, so did a little uh, review on that. Just the discussion. If you missed that video, I'll I'll link it down below if y'all guys want to take a look at it. But I'm gonna get in a more in depth review on it, I'm comparing it with my other setup. But so far, I'm pretty impressed with it. The efficiency on these motors too is, is just off the chain too. When you put RPM filters on here with uh, 48 hertz, six to seven minutes of flight time. Before I was getting five to six on stock which I really wasn't complaining about. But, you know, I just tried 48, see how much flight time I could get out of this thing. And I can get six to seven minutes now. So who doesn't want more flight time? Especially when you're flying a really nice quad like this that flies so well and nimble. Yeah, very, uh, very pleased with this motor. Hope it comes back in stock. Since uh, Chinese New Year and with this coronavirus going on, probably not gonna see it for a while. Same with the Maxino motor, so. I try not to go too crazy with this because finding a replacer motor right now is not gonna happen. But yeah, y'all guys get to hear how these motors sound in the air. And the props are running. Uh, the Gym Fan 3016, which has become one of my favorite props. I'm starting to like it more than the Avant, just because it's a little bit more efficient. The Avants are a little bit more grippier in the air, but the efficiency you get with this three blade prop is, is better. And it sounds it sounds really clean too as well. So we almost, I'm almost hitting like five minutes right here. But uh, yeah, I can, I can do six minutes of flying like this, even seven if I maybe tone it down a little bit. But yeah, this is, this is an awesome, uh, awesome motor. I really like it. But yeah, that's about it. Um, go ahead and bring this in and we'll go ahead and take this back to the bench
So that's gonna do it for my review of the FPV Cycle 1303 5K motors. If you're new to the channel, thanks for coming by and looking at my videos. I really, really appreciate it. Please like, comment, and subscribe. FPV is life. And I'll see y'all guys on the next one. Out of here. I don't wanna fight, I just wanna see ya Please give me a sign, yeah Please give me a sign if you wanna go